Archduke Franz Ferdinand is perhaps best known for being the spark that ignited the First World War. But there is much more to this historical figure than just that fateful event. Born in 1863 in Graz, Austria, Franz Ferdinand was the eldest son of Archduke Karl Ludwig and his wife, Princess Maria Annunziata of Bourbon II Sicilies. Despite being the heir to the Austro-Hungarian throne, he was known for his unconventional views and outspokenness, which often put him at odds with the establishment. Franz Ferdinand was also a passionate hunter and spent much of his free time pursuing game in his vast estates. He was particularly interested in big game hunting and made several trips to Africa and other parts of the world to hunt exotic animals. He even wrote a book about his hunting experiences, which became a bestseller in Austria and beyond. In addition to his passion for hunting, Franz Ferdinand was also a fervent advocate for the modernization of the Austro-Hungarian Empire. He recognized the need for reforms and worked tirelessly to promote social and economic progress. He was especially concerned about the plight of the country's minorities and championed their cause. Despite his many accomplishments and good intentions, Franz Ferdinand's legacy is largely overshadowed by his assassination in Sarajevo on June 28, 1914. The assassination, carried out by a Serbian nationalist, triggered a chain of events that led to the outbreak of the First World War. Had he lived, Franz Ferdinand might have been able to steer the empire in a more peaceful and progressive direction. In conclusion, Archduke Franz Ferdinand was a complex figure with many interests and passions. While he is often remembered only for his role in the First World War, there is much more to his life and legacy than just that. By understanding the full extent of his contributions, we can gain a deeper appreciation for this historical figure and the times in which he lived.